Whamcam, sponsored by your local Honda dealers. It's time to go wham! All right, folks, uh, check this out. It's a Phillips head screwdriver. Did you ever think about the name Phillips head screwdriver? Where does that come from? It can't be from a guy named Phillips. It can't be that easy, can it? It's time to go wham! Look at that thing. Where, why would it be called a Phillips head? Yeah, might be Mr. Phillips. Mr. Phillips. So you, you think it's that easy, some guy named Phillips? I think it might be. And what was his first name? Fred? Mike? Stanley? Phil. Phil? <laughs> Phillips. <laughs> Phillips, Phillips, Phillips. I've never seen a woman walking so, so confidently with a lamp. But I'm well lit. <laughs> Look at that, it's got the crosshair on it. Oh, hmm, not a flat head. Uh, I'm well lit. <laughs> it looks like a bayonet coming at you, right? Some guy named Phillips. And how arrogant and egotistical do you have to be to have your, your tool named after yourself? Only a man would do that. Exactly. The original name of that, which was uh, created in 1932, was by a guy named John Thompson. But he couldn't market it, it didn't sell, so he sold the design to Henry Phillips. Phillips. <laughs> and he marketed it in 1935, GM bought it, put it in Cadillacs, and the rest is history. It's named after Mr. Ego, Henry Phillips, but it should be a Thompson head. That is a... Wham! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> so what, what, I mean, do you like the uh, Phillips, or do you prefer a flathead? Uh, I prefer the one with the orange juice. <laughs> Boom! Oh. <laughs> what type of screwdriver is best? I guess we just heard. One or